Hey everybody, it's Andy, aka Max Rider. We're right back where we left off. Playing the Crooked Man. We have a bloody key. We have a couple other items. Mostly scraps of paper. We need a battery. And let's go pry open these elevator doors. No, let's not. Let's save first. I've checked everything out. I should have saved in between games. Prime open. Okay, here's the elevator. An elevator trunk, it's locked. Use the trunk key. Oh, yeah! Got an AED. What the heck is an AED? Can't read the tag? Automatic serial defibrillator. Oh, it's got some battery left, though. I'm not running into any water anyway to clean the tag off. So, I guess we can use the AED. <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, are your mom and dad not around? Did you come here alone? Are, uh, <clears throat> are you mute, perhaps? No, he was just singing. Mommy said not to talk to strangers. Ah, well, then I'll introduce myself. I'm David. I'm 26 years old. I live kind of far from here. Uh, my hobby is watching baseball, I guess. Oh, I like baseball, too. Mom, Mama gave me a glove, so, so I play every Saturday. Whoa, I'm jealous. Hey, so what's your name, little guy? Fluffy. Fluffy? That's your name? Yeah, Mommy says my hair's fluffy like a cow, so fluffy. I see. Where's your mama, Fluffy? I don't know. You don't know? Did you not come here with her? Uh, well, we were going back and home, and I was walking right by Mama, and then she went to get something she forgot. So I didn't want to go way outside, so I came in here and sang, but Mama hasn't come back. So, you got lost. Is your house close to here? Um, my house is close to school, but you can't see school from here, so I guess it's probably far. Right. You're really something. You're really something to have waited here all alone. Great. Uh, kid lost late at night. I think there's a sheriff's office nearby. Maybe I should take him there. Yep. Hey, Fluffy, it's scary in the dark, isn't it? How about you go with me to Mr. Policeman? Okay, let's go. No! What? What's wrong, Fluffy? I'll, I'll have Mr. Policeman show you a patrol car. Don't you want to come along? I'm not scared of the dark. I'm a big boy. You're a scaredy cat, aren't you? Fluffy! Better give chase, I guess. Then again, maybe his mom will find him. I won't be questioned by the police anyway. I'll take him somewhere safe if I see him again. All right, so there's Fluffy. The... Creepy weirdo kid. Let's get the AED downstairs. Is this lock battery operating? Oh. Place is abandoned. Okay, hold on. The notebook. 413. Interesting. Uh, 4489. Let's go ahead and jot that down real quick. Okay. Um, I'm guessing I can use the AED on an automatic external defibrillator. Battery shows about half charge. Open the lid and took out the battery. Put the battery in the lock device. And it is 4489. Boom. Release the number lock. Alright. What the hell? Ah! This place is huge. Staff room. Save before we. Grab this clue. 
There's something on the desk. Got the key to the counseling room. That's all the way up on the third floor. Okay, okay. Trash can's empty. Let's look around this place. I think counseling room's up on the fourth floor. Was it? Oh my goodness, excuse me. I have been sleeping very well. Director's room. There's a safe. A diary written by the director. I received a puzzle box the other day. Rather interesting thing to open it. You have to arrange the letter pieces to form a word. Of course, I made the keyword my favorite word, that irreplaceable thing which always makes me happy just to say. In fact, I should show the box to my daughter. That's it? Unbelievable. When I show my daughter the puzzle box, she hit all the pieces. But what's inside isn't really something you use every day, so it's not a huge deal. She actually gave me hints to where they are, but I can't find any. Maybe when I have time. More importantly, I don't know if I can bring myself to scold my troublesome daughter. Oh, it's a scrap of paper with the hints. Flour is good. Wash your hands. Where do you have lunch? Give me a call. Nurses know. Flour is good. Wash your hands. Where do you have lunch? Give me a call. Nurses know that. Get close to the sky. Ah, oh, God. So I gotta find the pieces. Is this the puzzle box? Wooden box, there are six indentations on top. I should get all six pieces first, otherwise I won't know how to arrange them. Still pretty flowers. They seem artificial. Oh, there's something in there. A piece? Boom, I got the Y piece. All right, so... Flower is good. Got that one. Wash your hands. It's in a sink. Where do we have lunch? There's got to be one in the cafeteria. Give me a call. A phone? Nurses know that. Oh, my God. Only a few books here. The Way of the Modern Family, Family and Medicine. Shelves are empty. Why would this guy... A locked safe. Where are we time-wise? Seven minutes already. Won't open. Emergency patient transport. Door won't open. Men's bathroom. Lock is busted. Aha! This bathroom lock is busted. Okay, well, where you wash your hands? There's a basement to this place? Holy mackerel, it's huge. Medicine room locked. Door plate is faded. Won't open. Stretcher. Hey, let's go to sleep. Okay. Nothing in the basement. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa, there's a note. Scrap from the notebook. My mother told me I was born here. She called it a place of happiness, but for me it's a place of regret. I wish I could kill my child self back when I was pure, when I still thought everyone loved me. This guy's got issues. Psychia psychi psychiatry. Oh my god. It's just place. This place is so big. Test tubes, a beaker and a flask. This is surgery rooms. Okay, where do you wash your hands in here then? Bathroom. Lock is broken. Radiology shut down. Cranial surgery is shut down. Psychiatry is locked. Okay. Public phone, there's something in the change slot. Boom! Oh, t -t 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 give me a call. Okay. Orphanology painted over. Meet maternity and gynecology. Where the babies are born. 
Model of an embryo. That's just a mysterious machine. A small key. Oh, There's so much to this. All right. Dermatology. Paint it over. Is this more surgery rooms? Whoa. There's x-rays put up on a whiteboard. These medical equipment. I'm going to have to look through every single one of the surgery rooms. Because I might have missed something. Examination table. Okay, these are all x-ray rooms, aren't they? The door with the three-digit code seems to be leading to emergency stairs. I don't have the three-digit code yet. Okay, so this is a lot bigger than we're going to be able to explore in one sitting, I'm afraid. We can take a quick look at the second floor. Pediatrics. <gasps> There's the kid! We'll deal with him and then we'll stop. There you are, Fluffy. Don't you know not to wander off alone? I can handle the dark fine. I told you I'm a big boy. I'm not going to cry like some baby. You sure do seem brave, Fluffy. I have to admire that. Really? <laughs> yeah, you're as brave as Captain America. I'm kind of scared of walking in the dark, but here I am looking for somebody. If only there was someone here to depend on. Just my luck. Okay. I'll go with you, Mr. David. Whoa, really? Wow, what a relief. Thanks. I feel so much safer with you here, Fluffy. <laughs> I'll protect you, Mr. David. We'll stick together until his mother shows up. If she doesn't, Sheriff's Office it is. Okay, so I got Fluffy with me. Nice. We're going to stop right there. So thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I appreciate it. And I will talk to you all next time.